Hey guys, it's Aliana and I'm back here with another video and today's video is going to be my January favorites and I'm sorry I missed last week's two uploads. I was just uninspired and I didn't feel as creative as I wanted to be and I was actually discouraged because a lot of people over I live have been starting YouTube channels and like that's great because there's a lot of room on YouTube. I've just been discouraged because they have been growing like way faster than me and I've been doing this for almost three years now. Downing myself and telling myself like there must be something wrong with you. Instead of dwelling on it, I just took a week break from YouTube. Oh not everyone's going to be as consistent as me because I put out two videos each week. That's that. Get right to the video. Okay and one thing I want to add is if you guys see a difference in the lighting is because I found this like strip of light it's the diva ring light but it's just a string light so i'm gonna be using that until i have the funds to get a diva ring light just gonna use what i have use my resources first category is going to be hair care because that's like the biggest category and i'll try to include the prices and everything on the first screen. thing is the shea moisture coconut and biscuits curl enhancing smoothie and if you're natural or a curly girl and you don't use this you need to use it because this is a truth type because it does everything it's supposed to do and it smells great and it's good for damaged hair i think i have some damage i'll insert like a clip of my hair when it's wet i use this for my wash and goes and my twist out it's my my winter twist out i use this and the next product i'll probably show the leave-in conditioner and that's one of my other favorites and my twist out came out bomb oh my god thing that i have is a shea moisture jamaican black castor oil strengthen grow and restore leave-in conditioner and ran out of this and i got this because my hair is kind of damaged i don't know why like i barely use heat on my hair it's so great it moisturizes my hair really well and i did the like porosity test and supposedly i have low porosity hair to really moisturize my hair and it's great for twist outs and Washing goes, so that's what I use this for. Shea Moisture products. Next thing that I have is a Shea Moisture Coconut Hibiscus Kids Curling Buttercream, and this was in my product haul from last year, and this is brand new, and they smell so good. And I use this for my twist outs and when I French braid my hair for protective style, and this really helps with defining my curls and keeping them first. Hi, I'm Jackie's Curls and Coils Classy Recipes for Funny Moisturizing Curls Cleanser. And that was a mouthful. But this is my cleanser. I use this as a shampoo because it does a job. It, even though it's sulfate free and paraben free, it has like no mineral oil, no my scalp like a shampoo. So this, I use this as like a replacement for my shampoo. And this does strip out your hair and it does leave it dry. So you have to follow up with a conditioner slash deep conditioner, whatever you use. I use this like every other day because I get a lot of product built up because I do use gel because most of the time I put my hair in a Next thing that I use is a Cantu Care for Kids Curling Cream and I use this for my twist outs or when I'm in the shower and I put my products on in the shower. This is great for that too. I use this only when my hair is completely wet because if I don't use it when it's wet, it's not going to really do anything for me. I like French braid my hair. The Cantu Shea Butter Leave-In Conditioner. I was phone. The next thing I have is the Cantu Shea Butter Leave-In Conditioner Repair Cream. And I got this because, like I said, my hair was damaged. And this does not mix well with, like, gels or any other products. I would only use this for a twist out or if I only want to use one product in my hair. Hi, I'm Jackie's Curls and Curls Foxy Recipes. Don't shake. Foxy Elongating Curling Gel. And I use this for my wash and goes because it doesn't give a lot of hold like if I want to do this kind of hairstyle. So I use this for only my wash and goes. It doesn't really do a lot for my shrinkage because I get really bad shrinkage. Like my hair shrinks up all the way up here by the end of the day. It does do the job as a gel and it doesn't get hard but this does leave um, like flakes if you don't like moisturize your hair or put an oil on top of it. Next product that I have is Eco Styler Professional Styling Gel Argan Oil and this is one of my favorite gels. I stopped using the green one because it left flakes and it would get really hard on my hair so I use this for my edges or when I'm doing six styles like buns and this smells like green apple. 
with Alma Oil from India. So this is supposed to smooth and touchable finish and it has a medium hold. I use this, I spray it over my twist outs or I could do it right now but but it smells really nice and even though it has alcohol on it so if you're like a big natural or if you like follow the natural hair rules I wouldn't use this because it does have alcohol on it but use this to just give like a nice shine and stuff on my hair. This is a Tresemme Professional Moisturage Conditioner and this conditioner is oh my god this is so moisture conditioner is so moisturizing and it smells so clean and fresh and I just love this conditioner so much and like I was saying my grandma had this at her house like a long time ago when I was at her house and I was washing my hair it has like white people hair so I was like this is probably not gonna work for me but I used it and it takes my knots away like as you saw in my wash day routine or my co-wash routine you saw this in my hair and it melts away my tangles and my knots and all that so if you have trouble detangling your hair i'd recommend this product this knockoff organics conditioner and and this is supposed to mimic the organics or ogx conditioner and i feel like it does the same job like i use this I use this conditioner and this conditioner because this one is only a dollar so I can use it. So this one is really moisturizing and it helps with detangling and stuff. But this one is, it's a watery conditioner. So that's probably why it was a dollar. This does the job and it's only a dollar and you can probably find it anywhere. Olive oil and I don't use coconut oil because it doesn't really do anything to my hair. It doesn't moisturize it or anything. Olive oil moisturizes my hair better than coconut oil so this is what i use and it's empty i use this for my skin like when i do my face mask if you guys want me to do a skincare routine please like this video okay so that's the last thing in the hair care section so the next one is going to be like body and skin is the eos evolution of smooth shave cream and i don't usually use shaving cream because it does dry out your skin but this one is really moisturizing and this really did leave my skin really smooth and soft and moisturizing and this one brightens an even skin tone and i know like as a woman of color or like a girl of color our legs get those like dots like pigmentation strawberry legs so this i hope this really does help even my skin tone and stuff it has natural shea butter vitamin b3 nourishes and soften skin the smell is pomegranate raspberry I have is this body coconut oil body care charcoal body wash and i love charcoal and anything like charcoal face mask charcoal bar soap and anything so i knew this was going to do the job and as you can see i'm basically almost done with this but i wanted to give some to bianca i feel like this has been helping like detoxifying my skin so i'm saving like some of it for her so i can let her try it and i got this at tj maxx really sleeping on like tj maxx marshall um ross's skincare aisle because they have stuff like this and like skincare stuff like that's how i got my charcoal um face wash and that has really helped with my scars and i also got my vitamin c serum that has really helped with my scars like that is my secret weapon this every day when I'm in the shower. Lip gloss is popping because this is like my favorite lip gloss of all time because it was only three dollars or I don't know how much it was but it was like three dollars at the beauty supply store and they have like so many flavors but my lips get really dry so I needed to get the coconut oil hydrating one so this is the one that I got and it's almost gone but this leaves my lips shining and moisturized and plump and all that stuff and it just looks good it's this shea moisture bar soap and this one is a coconut and hibiscus um brightening or something like that it's for like people with acne scars and acne so i use this every single day and it has really helped with my acne i have a couple breakouts like on my chin and stuff it's because i need to drink more water another one of my favorites it is the spin brush and I got this at Ross for $10, $10, even though it doesn't work, but it does a job. Like I wet this and I wet my face and then I do that and 
So if you guys want me to do a skincare routine, please let me know. Honestly, my favorite thing of all time because as you guys know, in my videos, in my old videos, you can see like I have really bad acne marks. And now mine aren't that bad, but they're still there. And this has helped. This is my secret weapon. Every time someone asks me, like, what do I use on my skin? I always say vitamin C serum because vitamin C serum it just like brightens your skin and it helps with acne and acne scars because it like makes new cells or something like that i don't know the science behind it but suffering from acne marks please get vitamin c serum it's natural um they probably have organic ones and this one was only four dollars at freaking marshall's and this was originally twenty dollars Raw boys coming to me with they open hands And I ain't tripping on the sand now Everybody wanna be my friend I finally fell in love Okay, so I didn't record this part But this is a necklace that my boyfriend got me Another one of my favorites is this water app, and it is called Water Minder. It basically tells you how much water you drink in, the, in a day, and it reminds you to drink water. So if you have trouble drinking water, I would definitely recommend to download this app. This isn't sponsored or anything, I just really love this app, and it really helps. You press this, and then you add how much water you drink. So if you drink like a bottle of water like Aquafina or whatever, it adds that to how much water you drink and you basically add how much water you drink until you're basically full. And this is the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you liked some of the things that I have or this helped you in some way, shape, or form. But remember to like, comment, and subscribe and follow me on my social media and please please leave video request down below so I know what kind of videos you guys want to see from me. And I just hope you guys have a productive and positive day.